everyone. I want to show you today how to use Excel's index and match to look up a value in a spreadsheet that's possibly in another spreadsheet, table, tab, whatever. Uh, even it can be a different file. I often find myself needing to look up a value in one table that's in another table. And I don't like to use HLOOKUP, VLOOKUP, or LOOKUP functions or ES functions because those are unreliable in returning the values I'm looking for. Match and index does better. So here's how you do it. I'm going to index the columns that I want to return. My second criteria, as described here by my formula, I need to return a row number. I'm just going to say row number two for now. And then my column number, I'm going to say column number two because I have two columns, columns A and B. Okay, a little typo there. There we go. So that returned the second row from my index. If I chose row three, I would see that it's green, right? But what I want to do is look up this value. So I'm going to replace my row with match. I want to match A2, and I'm going to choose column A from my other spreadsheet. It's in a different file. Press comma for the next value, and then my match type is exact match. I definitely want exact match. I will now close my function. And I still have in my index as my uh, third variable, or my third parameter, as the column number two. If I change column number two to column number one, you would see it returns actually my, my name, which was part of my index. I will return column number two, and there it is. If I come over here and search for that, you can see it's cream. If I change it to coffee, you can see it's changed to coffee over here. So that means my match is working. Now to get the rest of my values, I just simply need to copy my formula. And now I have all my values. And you can see these are the groupings of my values for column B to column A from another sheet. And that's all there is to it.